you, are you able to send us messages if we're in a different plane? Who are you talking to? Ixa. Give me a second. That would be pretty cool for a guardian to say, "Hey, bitches, you may want to, may want to come home." Better than nothing. Now we spell quaddle wrong. Yeah. Yes. Excellent. Um. Uh, okay, now I'm within our group. Which one of us can send can send messages to each other? Because that's the person that should receive it. Um, it's a powerful spell. A bit beyond send. our grasp. Hmm. I know. I I could do sending, but not yet. I I I know that spell is. Um, my my elder my elder brothers could do it. I just couldn't do it yet. So eventually, I'll be able to. There are speakers and stones that can 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 speak over long distances through the stones, of course. Is that how right. the rune stones were made? By the dwarves? <coughs> mm. I don't think so. We'll have to ask if anyone in Dvergholm knows about those stones. I know who they would be. Alright. Perhaps that's where we need to go then. Hooker, do you want to make sure that um, Ixamis Kala goes and places uh, the alarm spell properly? Give me a sense motive. Okay. 15. Lokrik's bluff is now plus three plus his charisma. <laughs> so plus six. He wants to have a chat with the party without you listening. Okay. <laughs> Oka <Okay>, goes. <laughs> okay. With slumped shoulders. <laughs> That wasn't very subtle at all. <laughs> no. Now, Lemmy. Yeah? Zildin, what did the mother say about Uker? We didn't get the whole story. Are we still sick? It's possible. We won't know until the summon. The full moon's in a few days, you realize. Any? What are we going to do? Isn't there some other way we can find? Find out what's going on before this. Today's the day of the ninth. The first full moon always happens on the 14th. Well, for Uker, I suggest we put the we put the belt on him. And for you, perhaps it's best that we keep you in, in chains or in a cage. I would submit to that. Not... I'm sorry, my friend. Just... Think of it that way. I wasn't found to be worthy. <laughs> hmm. Perhaps it's good to be small in some things. He means it as a compliment. Yeah. But what about the man who can pick up gargantuan statues and move tons of earth. Well, yeah, it would be, it would be his gosh. mind we'd have to control and not his body. Agreed. How do we slow him down, at least? Um, well, we can take his extracts away from him. It's not a bad idea. Make sure Perfect, he doesn't drink all those concoctions make sure he makes. He, he's not able to drink. What else? I don't think that would be enough. It's about all we got. Um, so we're just gonna let it happen and he's gonna run amok and 
kill well, people. Kill half the town. No, we can't allow Not that. if we leave him in Acropolis. Uh, leave him here. Sure, he wouldn't be able to travel. Well, he muck all he wants here. There's no one to kill. Hmm. Except for us. Even no, if we throw, even leave if him throws, here. <laughs> even if we throw spells all day at him, there's very little I can control him. Well, he might give Ximus Kala a difficult time. She could fly away, I suppose. Except for the statue. He knows about the statue. That's true. This place has got a funny sky. Maybe he won't change here. It's possible. Ideal, really, if that's the case, can skip the uh, full moon every month. Wouldn't be so bad. Oh, one of those things in the sky could be a moon. It's... Or maybe that moon won't make him change. Who knows? Won't know to I think try. it's best. I think it's best that we deal with it right away. If he's gonna turn, let's. Let's understand what's going to happen because we don't want to be in a situation where we can't, we don't have a choice. Right? How we do we not travel and we stuck? How do we, how do we know that he's changed? Um, silver. Based on what we've seen, silver. If he changes, it should be pretty obvious. <laughs> your your blood will react when it touches silver, or you will not feel good when you touch silver. I suppose that's you as saw. good as any. Silver plenty around here. Where are you going to train well, me? You, up? <laughs> you say that, but Grolf lived in a silver mine. Grolf was mad. Yeah, that he was. Mm -hmm. Maybe the silver drove him mad. Lemia thinks it could also be living by yourself for a He's long period of time for, and yeah, being cursed and you know, lived it's for probably all sorts of years of... on his own. It's <laughs> well, I'm happy I didn't meet him. Mm. No, yeah, but maybe Uka will have an idea of what he would like to do, how he would like to face this. My suggestion is we start we start with the belt. That'll be the f first thing we can try. And but we do need work. To, and exactly we need something else to make sure he can he can control us some other way. Any other spells that can control the mind? I'm. He looks at Obron. Um, I'll look through what I've got, but well, apparently really the master most... paralyzer is is Hilden. Well, yeah, it works all right for a time. Not a long time. Probably not enough time to put him down, you know, without killing him. We need what to if we just knock him out. Beat him up, beat him senseless before the full moon. <laughs> it's not a prospect I relish, but it'd be better than having him kill us or anyone else. Actually, that might work too. That does work. I think we should just find out if um, mm. he'll change in Acropolis. Here. Uh, what about this? What about I this? prefer. I prefer to do Silver. it somewhere else. Silver Why? is anathema. Where the Where are you going to do it where there's no people? Silver is anathema to the wolf. What if we made him bonds of silver? Make him what with silver? Bonds of silver, chains. I think you just the break them. He's not weak against silver. It's just it'll hurt him, but he'll still be able to tear it like it was butter. You guys fought Grolf. Lemio saw him regenerate the day before. Give me a knowledge nature, Lemio. Okay. Uh, no large natorb. No, I'm not going to sleep soon, guys. <laughs> knowledge natorb. Mm -hmm. 21. Um, you did realize that um, Grolf did regenerate, and because you did know that Azildan pegged him with a, um, a silver arrow right before, um, 
right before he got the death blow from Galath. Mm -hmm. uh, that silver stops his regeneration in the same way that fire stops troll regeneration. Silver behaves the same way that it does uh, as fire will, will affect trolls. They, will, they won't be able to regenerate as fast. The so, minor werewolves did not have regeneration, but Grolf did. Right. Putting him All in right. silver chains might very well just stop his regen. Fine then, silver chains. Well... If we want him to stay unconscious, we'll need to do that. Hmm. We'll have to let Ixa know when it comes close to the day what she's going to be dealing with. Well, we're going to have to be here as well, won't we? No, we won't. Well, I, I, can, do, I can be around. Why? You want to get eaten? I want to see if I can at least talk to him. Someone's yeah, going to have to try to use that. Someone's going to have to try to use the belt. Oh, you just put the belt on him, right? And then someone's going to have to use the charm of lighting. Yeah, before he changes, you tell him to sit and stay. <laughs> Not because he's a dog, but because that would be handy if he would just do that. <laughs> <sighs> Commanded to lick his balls until sunrise. <laughs> <laughs> he has a special, special memory of <laughs> his transformation to. <laughs> hey, I can reach. Oh. <laughs> no. <laughs> Okay, Uker's wandering back. It, 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 it scowl went over and cast the alarm spell. And I don't know if you say anything to the big, big snake thing. That's, that's the right spot. Hmm? That's the right spot. Yes. <laughs> Thanks a lot. <laughs> I'm only here because they don't want me there. <laughs> Are you the black sheep? I might be the grandson of the wolf god. Thing. Mm. Fireball. <laughs> <laughs> I'll remind you that I'm the guardian of this place. By command of <coughs> Petra, my mother. Wolf God. <laughs> Grandson, but, but, uh. Uka, oof. It says to you. Well, it is the word for wolf. It's. Uka, oof. <sighs> You cheer me up very well. <laughs> the spell is placed, it says. It goes and sits back on the Temple of Laws overlooking it. Nuker comes wandering over slowly. Yep. Oh, Uker. Mm. But the spell is in the right spot. We were talking about uh, the coming full moon five days from now. Hmm. I'm going to submit and be allowed to be put into chains, perhaps in the jail of... Um, Runeshot. Uh... <laughs> no jail cell would be able to hold you. <laughs> um, what is your base strength of just raging? Uh, my base strength raging yeah. uh, is... Something? No, 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 it's 25. Um, if you add a hybrid or anything like that in there, you get to 27, and then my strength checks add 6 to that, so it would be 30, effects right. of 32, it would be like a, 
it'd be a plus seven and then an additional plus uh, six on top, so 13 on the strength checks. Maybe plus 14, so you're looking at DC 30s without Mythic. Assuming I burn all my Mythic. We should... Without... <laughs> We should have some hard conversations as to how we're going to handle this and where we're going to place you. Um, you guys are now walking back towards the pavilion. Uh, I haven't tried to run through a wall yet, but I think I've got the technique down. <laughs> oh yeah. Like when I kick the back of the boat, I can probably go through wooden wall easy. Right. Without oh, spells. Then. Okay. You return by way of. You return to Featherstone, and then by way of Stone. Return to Runeshod. I think that's where we'll end tonight. Um, I'm going to give you guys some XPs. It only took us five hours to beat that puzzle. No, 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 today. No, no, no. Five hours to beat the puzzle combined. Oh, okay. That's not bad. So, five hours times four men. It's twenty man hours, <laughs> and then you discovered, you, Marty. you discovered the <laughs> Marty. the Atlas thing and how to charge. The if thing. we would have picked up on the musical cues early, there yeah. would have been, been it would have been that. Well, it would have been that. Do re mi fa so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it's it's it's. And really, it's and that's when I'm like, it. is this too obvious? Are they just gonna automatically go? Oh, that's just the fucking alphabet of the fucking music scales and. No, because I think only Mark has a significant music background here. Uh, <laughs> Mark has no music no, background. No. I'm the only one with a music background here, and really, I did. Music I did instruments that I, I never did singing. Uh, and then when I did do singing, it was with actual notes, like A, B, C, D, E, F, G. Right. right. So there is a musical language that is called Sol, Re, Sol. And the idea behind the musical language was uh, to help people translate meaning, to help multiple cultures talk to each other without learning other languages. If everyone learns how to talk, this universal language is what it's called. So if it had been binary, we would have figured out like that. Right. <laughs> yeah. But... <laughs> Now, why why Sol Re Sol, and then why you know, yeah, why did they choose music? Well, music was the way that they chose to activate this portal thing. And yep. I love the fact that we we boiled it down to scale. And you're like, there's so many meetings of scale, and I was just sitting there chuckling, like, hey. which meeting? Hey, and you're hey, like, I was the one that all of them. Scale, so this is all this is all me. I I did it. You guys didn't contribute at all. <laughs> Fuck you, John. <laughs> All right. So I'm well, and then I was sitting there. I was sitting there. I was looking at the. I was looking at the. the I was looking at the, the characters, and I was like, "Dude, oh my god, oh god, no! That's what it is." <laughs> yeah. um, so I'm gonna call this one the Ring of the Gods. Sure. That's a good name. And I'll give you guys five thousand XP, which is what you need for half half what you need remaining for your level. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna consider discovering and figuring out the riddle of the of the Ring of the Gods with very little help. Um, a mythic trial. Unfortunately, it's a mythic trial before towards a future tier because you still haven't found out what your sources are yet. I think what? my source is Fenrir. I don't know. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> We go find people, we beat them up until they tell us who our source is. So, um, the question as to why are we special has never been answered, and so you don't actually know how to make, like, is it push-ups that I'm supposed to do, or sit-ups, or am I supposed to do lots of math equations? You don't know how to, to make Done. yourself more powerful. Uh, I'm pretty sure math think... equations aren't my exercise. <laughs> <laughs> I think lemmies, lemmies is going to be like trees and shit. 
trees and shit. Let me just eat a bunch of okay, pine so cones tree. I'm going to mark down that you guys have completed a mythic trial of discovering the Ring of the Gods and, and unlocking its um, activation. I also made a poo-poo. <laughs> it was... The effects were used, sir. DC 30-something freaking fear saves. And, and, ah. it's, and it's unlocking the Ring of the Gods on Acropolis as well. It's, there's a particular reason why I'm calling that out that you may not know. Yeah. Um, so this basically means that uh, some of you, all it will take to go to your ne next mythic rank is to discover your source. Yes. So do we just go around asking, are you my daddy? Like... Yeah, I, that's what I was gonna do. Okay. Uh, sorry, but so so by source means like oh, no, sorry, activity. Sorry. I, I'm 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 wrong. Your ascension was to get your first one, then you need three things for your second one. So this does apply to your your second. This is actually getting you one step closer to your. Uh, uh, so okay. killing the cool killing the monster wasn't one. No, no, was it me? was. You need three yeah. trials for a second tier. Yeah. Okay. You need a so, three group trial. Yeah. A, Source trial. We did that. And a discover source. You still need to discover your source, and then and then uh, Oberon still needs one more. So. Um, yeah, Oberon can go suck a dick. Maybe that's his trial. <laughs> that's, that's his source. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, I'd be worried about one of the charisma so... guys for the. Uh... <laughs> Oh damn it! My source is sucking dick. Yeah, so I'm I'm basically all that remains for some of you is to discover what your source is. Um, okay. And I think you guys know someone who might be able to help you out with that. It might be late, but I'm thinking Petra. Yeah. All answers are Petra. Balls. I don't want to. I don't want to be in debt to that bitch. I do. She knew about. She's the one that knew about Zenith. Yep. And I think she even dangled this particular question in front of you guys. Mm -hmm. I might. I might ask her, because I could use an extra mythic rank maybe in a bit here. <laughs> All right. So yeah, this this was this was actually a really good game. I am going to post this one, and then and then we'll uh, maybe. Maybe replay it via Twitch, and we'll see how that works. Yeah, there's there's got to be the clip of us all humming it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And everybody's gonna hum six it. hours later. I'm just gonna include that, no matter whether six hours actually passed. I'm just gonna include it because there was there was some good back and forth, and you guys were getting yeah. really really close and zooming in. Um, and then and then suddenly it's like. I want to go and touch the ring again. It's like, well, what? No. <laughs> tap, tap, tap. Okay, it feels, it feels nice. All right, and fuck you, ring. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to go somewhere fun. I, I actually I had an encounter in mind. Had you guys kind of stumbled into this, into this place? Like, Just let's go in. in. <laughs> no. That's called the capture that, encounter. That yeah, that would have been a completely different encounter. Um, well, well, we'll see. We'll see tomorrow when I summon those. Elementals, what they say. All right. Uh, even though we didn't have a live audience tonight, are there any shout outs? Shout out to um, my wife for letting me play. Like <laughs> um, yeah, in a similar conversation. Sirak, so we haven't seen him in a while. Yep. yep. To some of the viewers, uh, good call tonight calling game, Mark. I know that it's uh, holidays for you, so I think that's why we got yeah. the extra game in. And thanks, guys, for uh, for making time. Yeah, man. Uh, that was that was good pretty times. fun. Yeah. Good times. Okay. All right, folks. We solved it. We're awesome. Yes. Yes. We uh, so we will resume regular time. That's regular why we're back this Saturday. I think everyone's in for the Saturday, huh? Yep. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. That's time. And then, what are you guys going to do? Are you guys going to prepare for Uker's transmorphation? Yeah, probably. Yeah. I'm assu I'm hoping that doesn't take eight hours. Transformation. No. You can get your strength up, but your con's still not getting up that high. I'm pretty sure I can fill you with arrows once you start ranging. You know, it from a flying position. <laughs> from a flying position. <laughs> it all depends on... Like, the AC starts to get kind of good. Potentially. Okay, do you have do you have fly potion? I'm 
not telling you now. <laughs> Fucking hope not. No, no, oh, we're great, there's a flying Hulk so, that so bites I, people. I think great. there is, whether you do it next game or not, very soon, you're going to have to deal with Uker whether you do pre, pre-prep pre for it. I think pre-prep or not. is probably a good idea. I would suggest pre-prep. Okay, so that's something to think about, is is what the fuck are you going to do? I uh, think the other players should think about it. Cause, okay. Because it's done his personality to be like, how do I lock myself in the crackers box? <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to be in the like the silver rebar written little cage thing where if yeah, I change well, it, that and there's me. only five days before this occurs, right? So it's not like yeah. you can have all these fancy things built. Um, I, I might let them know that the snake lady threatened to kill me. <laughs> uh, I, I like the idea of beating him down with non-lethal damage and putting yeah. like a silver yeah. collar on him. <laughs> yeah, just beat him down. No healing for you. <laughs> Beat him down for the duration of three days. <laughs> I'm a, I'm an in based caster person. I need that. <laughs> Brain damage is bad. Beating him. <laughs> I like how the good characters. Their first thing. Let's beat him up. <laughs> it's either that or kill his ass. Let's keep what him on the edge of death. It's not lethal damage. You'll be fine. <laughs> oh yeah, it'll be funny if like his like growth was like regening. Like he passed. Silver him. stops your regen. Sorry. <laughs> and it's fine. I'm just saying that he was regenning. All right, so... Oh, Adam's um, frozen? Adam's yeah. suggesting that the other players actually have a serious think about it, <laughs> I, I think is what is, is what his ask yeah. is. So um, uh, why, not, why not start a sheet just like you did for the, um, uh, for the puzzle? Like, ideas on how to keep Uker something. Something. Yes. Yes, um, and then we can, you know, you get a few days to think about it. I'm sure you guys will come up with something creative. Uh, I'm not even going to think of it as a DM. I'm just going to go, I already know what happens to Uker when he transforms. I know all the roles that need to be made. Uh, I've got a nice cheat sheet on how, how his character sheet changes and all the stats that have and what his powers are. So I've already done my DM homework. Um, uh, it turns out that Uker actually was bitten by a werebear as a baby, and he just... Like turns into a bear and goes in the forest and eats berries. I don't think that's what happens. <laughs> I'm just guessing. Or maybe a salmon. A salmon. <laughs> it is a curse. Lycanthropy is a curse, and it's a <laughs> mythic version of this curse. It's not supposed to be without struggle, a way for you to get free power. However, yes. given that this is a mythic campaign and you guys are creative. There may be a very, very long-term arc where Adam might have to make a decision whether he lives with it or not. Like, like, it's a thing that can he, can he control it versus can he cure it? Might be two paths that you guys have to take. Um, yeah. So, um, Uker Ulf um, might be around for a while. Okay, like, cool. Uh, so I'm gonna, I've already I'm gonna, created the sheet and started it. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to end, the, uh, I'm gonna end the, uh, um, uh, the recording right now. Uh, thanks for watching and tune in uh, next time for Die Dragon Die Presents Legends Campaign. Peace.